Hello Sagittarius and welcome back to my channel Messages from Venus. This is your reading for September 28, 29. Oh my gosh, I was going to say 2018, girl bye. Um I have 25% off. Please check out your astrologers as well so that they can give you um an incentive of what's going on astrologically, you guys. If you guys have any questions, let me know. Please like, share, comment and subscribe. Um I will be pulling out four cards for each sign and an oracle card. I'm not going to 15 20 minutes on readings sorry now let's get started Sagittarius um okay hold on so okay Sagittarius so I see you guys being like wounded soldiers and where I feel like you guys have been traumatized, beat down, beaten down, taken down, wrestled down, and people are still looking for more. And the, and, and the best thing about it is, is that you're out here out to give it to them, Sagittarius. You're like, oh, you guys want more? Oh, I got this. You know, I feel like you guys are in situations, predicaments where people test you. The universe has tested you and you guys have came out up on top. Um, when matters of the heart and matters of the soul, you guys are continuing to fight for your own emotional stability. For those of you that are single and want to mingle, the second week of the month is the best time to do so. For those of you that are in relationships, continue to fight for your relationships. Um, it's better to have an empty cup than have no cup at all. Now, for um, as far as inheritances, money is concerned, plans are concerned, always think about the future, yes, but don't spend 50% of your time thinking about the future and the rest of your time thinking about everybody else in your future and leave yourself out of it. Don't do that. Um, make sure that you do not forget about yourself. Um in the process of creating a better life for yourself, okay? Because that's the reason why people keep coming for you because they think you're going to do this this ring around the rosy with them all the time and you're not. You have to focus on yourself. Focus on yourself and sometimes you have to let people win battles so that you can be able to win the, the war. So don't forget about that either. Um, and then... For those of you that know that something is wrong, know that something is wrong or right, or know that something is out of place, um, that is that is correctly out of place or incorrectly out of place, uh, try to get whatever that thing, person, situation is back into its correct and rightful um, place. Uh, put people, places, and things back where they belong. Uh, and if you guys, if you have to continue to fight, then go ahead and continue to fight. If you have to continue to fight for your marriage, relationships, inheritances, please do so. For those of you that are work dealing with people that you have to constantly, constantly be in competition with, what's going to save you is your intuition. Okay. So try to stay in tune with your intuition. If you feel like you're going to get fired within the next like, um, two weeks or so, then prepare for the worst. But, um, that's not going to happen to you if you follow your intuition, okay? So we're, the universe is going to test you, but we're going to come up on top. So here you go. We have protection, you guys. We, we have protection from situations that other people want to throw at us. We have protection from evil eye and people that are jealous because you are on top. Because just because these two um, cards have to do with cups doesn't mean that it, it's not... Um, it doesn't have to involve strategy. Cups also in, involves strategy because... We sometimes have to be emotional or emotionally connected before we can go ahead and move forward with um, certain situations, okay? And so whatever situation is going to happen within the next two weeks at work, make sure that you guys are uh, aware that you guys are being protected, but it doesn't mean that you don't always fight to be up on top, okay? So be up on top. For those of you that are experiencing evil eye, um, from people that you have to fight from, know that you are being protected, but it doesn't mean that you don't stop the fight. If you have to continue to fight, fight. But if not, there's certain fights and some some um, certain battles you just don't want to get into. Let them win those battles and win the war. Focus on the bigger picture, okay? So I hope you guys enjoyed this reading, and I will see you guys next month. Bye, guys.